that we may fear losing God's friendship forever by our dependency. That we may see Christ's mercy and forgiveness constantly in the sacrament of penance. That we may be aware of God speaking to us in the events of daily life. That we may pray daily with love and trust, especially in moments of temptation. That we may realize the value of worshiping God together in the Eucharist. That we may grow in the love of Christ that we were by frequent communion. That we may reverence of our bodies as temples of the Holy Spirit. That we may strive to be two Christians by our loving concern for others. That we may proclaim the dignity of work by doing our own work conscientiously. That we may forgive from our heart the those who have wronged us. That we may see the evil of seeking our own interest at the expense of others. That we may work for the just distribution of this world's goods. That we may share our problems with others for the good of the community. That we may accept our responsibility in the community in the spirit of genuine service. To bring the Holy Spirit with guide and strengthen Pope Francis, the bishops, and the clergy. That we may be blessed with an increase in priestly and religious vocations. That we may bring the knowledge and love of Christ to those who do not know Him. That we may be aware of our dependence in God in the midst of human achievements. That we may be ready at death to enter the home of our Heavenly Father. That we may die at peace with Christ and our fellow men. That we may be comforted to the death of our redeemed ones by our hope in the risen Lord. To pray that our important brothers and sisters will be shared in your Son's resurrection. Please mention the personal intentions. Holy Mary, help us in our needs. Pray for all the people of God. We all experience your perpetual help. Lord, you gave us Mary to be our mother, ever ready to help us. Grant us the grace to have recourse to her in all our needs. Amen. Please all stand.
so Thanksgiving prayer. Lord Jesus Christ, to the precious and the most precious of the Eucharist, we adore you. Yes. It has pleased the Father that in all you will soon bless you to your life, and that through you he shall be reconciled to all things to himself. Grant us the grace to be truly grateful for all that our Father has done for us. Grant that we may be truly sorry for our sins and to do penance for them. To you, we thank the eternal Father for the gift of life. He has created all the wonderful things of this world for us. May we learn to use them well so that through them we may grow in love for Him. Above all, we thank our Father for sending you to us as the greatest expression of His love to save us from all creation by your death and resurrection. We thank you, Lord, for giving us your own mother to be our mother of perpetual power. We need to come to these papers we have received to have our intercession and especially to reach the women, inspire us to greater confidence, God's love and mercy, and her perpetual help. Grant that we may always be the only people of God and persevere in His love. To the most holy Trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, be glory and glory and thanksgiving. For ever and ever, even. Prayer for the sick. Glory to Jesus Christ, you bore our sufferings and I am our sorrows, in order to show us clearly the value of human weakness and patience. Raise to see here our prayers for the sick. Grant that those who are really wrong, with pain and other afflictions of illness, they may realize that they are now the chosen ones, hoping you all blessed. Help them to understand that they are united with you in your sufferings. For the salvation of the world. Amen.
Christ and mystery of the death and resurrection of your Son. You accomplish the way of man's redemption. Full of trust, we proclaim the Paschal mystery in the sacramental signs of thy goodness. Help us to see ever growing in us the fruits of your saving word. And so we ask this through Christ our Lord. The divine gracious, blessed of the God, blessed be His holy name, blessed be Jesus Christ, through God and to man, blessed be the name of Jesus, blessed be His most sacred heart, blessed be His most precious blood, blessed be Jesus, the most sacred of the Lord. Blessed be the Holy Spirit, the Paraclete. Blessed be the Great Mother of God, Mary of Most Holy. Blessed be her holy and immaculate conception. Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, the Virgin and Mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. Blessed be God in the city of Jesus and Jesus. Thank you.